What's going on YouTube? Today I'm going to talk to you about skating styles, shot styles, and a couple of settings you need to change in NHL 24. Let's start with the reason most of you are probably here, skating styles. I'm going pretty similar to last year, but I'm changing it even less. I do not change my skating style for any like to copy any pros or high levels. I just want to make it more aesthetically pleasing to me. And that's what I did here. You can copy this down. I'm going to show screenshots of what other YouTube videos say pros use and what you see a lot of high level players using. I've used this style before a couple of times. I don't notice any difference in how I play and how I pick up pucks and how I retain balance and how I skate fast. To me, it feels purely aesthetic, but there are a lot of people out there who will tell you it is not purely aesthetic. So think what you want to think, change it how you want to change it. You can go all 99s or you can do what I do. It really, I mean, it might matter, but I don't think it matters. The only attribute here I truly believe can help you and your gameplay is hustle style. And let me show you some gameplay to help explain. Hustle style two keeps the puck very far out on the backhand. What does this do? When you're a right-handed shot and you mainly play on the left boards, when you're skating the puck up, it will keep the puck almost against the boards and far away from anyone who's on the right side of you trying to take the puck away. And if you're a left-handed shot on the right boards, it'll keep the puck on the boards and keep anyone from the left, it'll keep it further away, okay? It helps protect the puck when you're hustling up the boards. I hope that explains it. I hope the gameplay helps. I use Hustle Style 1 just because I play everywhere. I never really touch style three, but if you're, you know, a wing that plays on either side in sixes, it might actually do you some good to put that on. Next into shot styles, I go shot style 20. I think that's Austin Matthews wrister and I love Austin Matthews and I go one timer style 19 just because it looks the coolest to me. Now for some settings that you definitely should change and these have a very big impact on your gameplay and can have a very big impact on your gameplay. First, auto backskate, always turn this off. Just use LT. You don't want to get caught skiing backwards when you want to be transitioning. You know, it, it sucks, okay? Another thing, if you play a lot of goalie, turn tether off. It's terrible. You might like it if you're new at first, but I promise you it's terrible. For controls, I go total control. It's really personal preference if you want skill stick or total control. I like to do the Michigan sometimes, so I, I use total control, but do not use hybrid. Even if you're new, even if you know it looks a bit enticing just to press X for a wrist shot or A to pass, it's, it's horrible. Do not use hybrid. Total control or stick or skill stick is your best bet. For camera angle, I use overhead. I think it's the best camera in the game. It stays relatively fixed. It gives you a huge view of the game. There's not a whole bunch of extra stuff on the side. I love it. <clears throat> I highly recommend overhead. I don't recommend much else, but if you want, zone can also be pretty good. It's also pretty far away. I'd recommend getting used to a camera that's far away just much better to see the whole ice and know where your teammates are, know where the puck is, know where everybody is, use overhead or zone. That's pretty much it. Last thing on ice trainer. I turn all this off except for offside warning, which is adaptive. I don't even think that does anything, but I just keep it on that. That's the whole video. Those are my settings. Let me know if you guys liked them. If you think skating style really does matter, if you see a huge difference, please let me know in the comments because I feel it's just, it's just a placebo. I don't think it makes that much of a difference. I've changed it so many times and I just keep going back because I don't like looking like a goober out there swinging my arms around. But I'll show the 99s up again just in case you guys want to try that out. If you think it does actually work, please let me know in the comments. I have not had any success with it. Let me know in the comments if you guys like that 99 stuff. And I'll see you in the next video. Peace.